right guys, here we are, Half Moon Bay. Gonna have my second successful day of the year. Open. Uh, brought my camp stove, brought my pot, brought myself some uh, good old Jinshin ramen. So, pretty excited for this trip. As always, I need to bring home some crabs. The wife said she won't let me come in if I don't catch some crabs. Red Rock, Dungeness, anything, man. And this is the plan today. Today is going to be a, a competition between smoked oysters with squid, sardines with squid. If you think the smoked oyster is going to do better, let's do a thumbs up. If you think the sardines are going to do better, let's do a thumbs down. It's a competition of smoked oysters with sardines. Uh, I'm hoping to catch something right away. It's about uh, noon right now, the high tide. It is going down to around three o'clock. It's gonna be a low tide. And I'm thinking right around then is when I'm gonna have some good luck. There isn't much uh, coefficient after the low tide switches. So let's go, man. Gonna catch my first keeper Dungeness of the year. Let's hope, hoping. So let's go guys, fish and trial and error. Let's catch some crabs. All right, let's get naked. Got my little box of snares here. Here we go, we got the smoked oysters here. Let's see if we can open this up with one hand. Oh yeah, let's put some there in the trap. I got some squid in there with it. Nice. All right, there we go, oyster crab trap ready. All right, let's get the sardine one ready. All right, here we go, we got some sardines and soybean oil. crackers too. Oh yeah, there we go. Alright, here we go. We got the sardine and squid trap. Let's give it a go. Alright. Alright guys, here we go. Number one here, the smoked oyster with squid. Let's see the likes for the smoked oyster. Smoke squid number one, I got the sardines number two. Hoping to uh, catch something the first reel. I'm gonna let these guys soak for five minutes, five to ten minutes. Set my alarm right now so I don't forget. So I'll see you guys in about five minutes. Man, I went to the store. They didn't have my knots. Alright, first reel in. Smoke oysters, let's see if it does it. Smoke oysters one man. I gotta eat all of that. Alright, smoke oysters one man. Just a little guy. Cool. Alright, here's the sardines. Let's see if the sardines does a good job as a smoke. Oysters. Check my drag, alright. I 
think anything. All right, got these guys in. They ate that meat so fast, so I'm only gonna let them soak here for five minutes. They're hungry for smoked oysters, sardines, and squid today. So it's gonna be hard to do the competition, but still keeping track. Oysters up one, un undersized, but sardine, man, that thing was empty. All right, let's go, guys. Let's see if the smoked squid does it again. Oh, the smoked squid, smoked oysters and squid. Whew. Come on, baby. Uh, nothing this time. All right, they're buying, man. They're buying, here we go. Everything's getting ate and this is the sardines. Nothing, I don't think. See on the menu, this is what I got for the crabs. I got some calamari stuffed with sardines. Mmm, calamari stuffed sardines, my favorite. All right, smoked oyster, come on. Come on, smoked oyster, let's go. Oh yeah, got something. Feels good too, baby. Feels good. Feels good. Nice and easy. Oh. Barely got it. Oh, that was dangerous. Oh. Let's see if he's big enough. Oh. Too short, guys. Probably wasn't going to keep her anyways, but... Um, the inside there... Barely. Alright. Throw her back though. At least I caught a nice heavy one that's kind of reeling. Too bad its claws are going to fall off. That sucks. It's like I wonder if I could keep that claw if it's about to fall off. But probably not. Not worth it. Alright. You guys see that? I've heard of some dead seagulls around here in California. I remember hearing something about it, but yeah, I've seen like two so far this year. Uh, anyone know what's going on with the dead seagulls here in California? Anyone comment down below? All right. I don't know, I don't know about you guys, but uh, the sardine needs to start picking it up here. Hasn't done nothing. Uh, all right, I think there's something on there, so let's see. I don't think so. Hey, bang bird, get out of here! Hey, shoot! Get! Hey! All right, well, I'll change the trap on the sardines. Snare is a little bad, so. Just not losing faith yet in the sardines. All right, so it looks like the smoked, smoked oysters are killing it right now. It's been getting like, my bait's been getting eat. I caught two from there. Sardines, when I first got here, it was, they were eating it, but now it looks like they might be slowing down. But uh, right now, I think it will slow down, even though I did catch a female. The, as you can see here, it's getting, uh, I think, yeah, it's going down to the low tide right now. 
So when you get that exchange between the low tide and once it starts getting to high tide, that current is super strong. So uh, you're gonna need to have a little more weights there. That coefficient, you're know, looking at like a foot an hour of water going from the high to low tide. So, but around like three o'clock, then it should be stopped. That's how uh, I have some good slack there. Should have no uh, currents there for a little bit. And yeah, even after that, it's not going too much. The exchange when it's going back to the high tide. So I'll probably be staying out here till sunset. Uh, I was excited here when I got here is they're killing it. Catching crabs, eat my bait. Every five minutes, just had to keep on putting more bait in my cages. But now it looks like it is slowing down a little bit. Like I said, that uh, current's pretty strong. So they're probably just hunkering down in the sand. So hopefully uh, once that slack comes, the big ones come out first to start eating. So I might uh, start making myself a meal here, but I would like to catch a crab to eat with it. I'll let you know. Oh no, no, what am I doing? Oyster stuffed, wait, calamari st stuffed with oyster? Ooh, look at that, oils, yummy. All right, let's put it in here. Come on, sardines. Really counting on you, man. Let's do this. Oh yeah, I think there's something there, baby. Question is, what is it? Ooh, might be a delicious red rock I can eat. Oh yeah, a little red rock. That's just what I needed. It's getting this claw right now, so let me bring him over to my camp. All right, here we go. I got a little red rock. Let's see how small this guy is. like four and a half inches about four and a half inches here so in the inside of here of the carapace it's just a small guy but like I want to eat some crab out here man they only need to be four inches red rocks Four and a half inches. You know what? I'm gonna eat them. Cause I'm hungry and I want some ramen. So I'm gonna crack this guy open to get to it. All right. He ain't much, but it's four and a half inches here. I'm gonna eat this little guy with my ramen, so I have some crab flavor in there. Looks like I scrape myself, or he pinch me. It doesn't. I just scrape myself. But anyways. <laughs> There we go, got my crab going. Some delicious crab. Got that stock boiling. Got the ramen. So I would have suspected it's slowing down right here, but around three o'clock I should pick up again. Alright sardines. I know you've been doing it. Don't stop a good thing. It. Damn it, I surfaced it. It was a small one though. It was a small one. So that's a uh, two for smoked oysters and two for sardines. Oh man, almost getting done, man. It's gonna be so good. It's gonna be better than last week's because uh, 
I just know where this. <laughs> All right, I have a couple more minutes. I'm gonna eat this. I have to reel my end here in a little bit too. All right, man. Oh, I'm so excited to eat this. Man, four. Got the crab in there for a good uh, 20 minutes. I wanted to get some of the flavor out of the shell. Of course, always cook my noodles to al dente. So I had the noodles in there for four minutes, four and a half. For al dente recommendation. Ooh, shoot, my alarm. Alright, means I have to reel these guys in. Let's see if this is too hot. Let's see what you're I kind of want to eat it while it's hot, though. Spiciness from the, the ramen there, but then you've tasted crab right away. It's like a it's very like a deep crabby flavor, not like a sweet, but it's still good. Oh man, I'm starving too. Getting a little windy up. Spicy. Alright, cheers guys. That light kitchen cooking on the spot can't get any fresher than that all right i do want to taste this this body here a little bit Oyster time. Not that man. Not this real one, but the next one I'll have one. Yeah, got one. Doesn't feel too heavy, but. So you just want to keep slack on the snare the whole time. <laughs> so yeah, this is a red rock. They're good eating. I just made one up for lunch here. This is the female. The females look like a Taj Mahal. The males look like an Empire State Building. This, this, yeah. So this is a female, but big enough for sure. Yeah, you can. Rec a commercial can't though. And then it's from here. The inside part. Oh, this is huge, yeah. Six inches, five, three fours. There we go. Bring something home to the wife. So she won't. Yeah, you gotta you gotta keep the shell in case the DNR come by for the wildlife to make sure it's big enough. Alright, cool. Oh well, man, thanks for the good luck there.
All right, good deal. All right, let's see a two for two. Yeah, I need... Because yeah, all that, those crabs can be a couple pounds. Oh, another one. Oh, this is a bigger one too. Oh man, that almost feels like two of them. Here's the dungeons. This is legal too, I bet. Almost. Let's see, it'll be a close one. Yeah, six inches. Five and three fourths. As long as it's inside of this line right here. Yeah, you have to go from the inside. Okay. So it's yeah, six inches. Wow, you're gonna have to do every day. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, cool. Enjoy, yeah, thanks, Matt. Thanks for the good luck, you brought. <laughs> yeah, two keepers in a row. That's that's pretty good. That's pretty cool, man. Crab back to back. Red Rock keeper. Don Jones keeper. As it predicted, right after three o'clock, they're hitting. So I'm gonna keep on going until I can't catch no more. Or the sun goes down. Oh yeah. <laughs> Keepers in a day so far. The dungeon is going to be delicious. Got a fan there, not a fan, but a guy from Alberta. He's watching me in there. He's never caught anyone catch a crab out here. Or catch a crab ever. Pretty cool, man, showing him around. And he brought the luck because I caught those crabs back to back. So let's reel these guys in. Let's see what we got. Let's go. Three versus three. We got three crabs for the smoked oysters and three for the sardines. Oh yeah, another one. Oh baby, come on. I need to get down there though. No, I lost it. No. All right, we got ourselves a four. Close one. Been officially four. Four, four for the smoked octopus. Three for the sardines. Let's go sardines. Hopefully the DNR don't come out here, the game warden, because Seagull just took the carry pace of that red rock I had. At least I got some photo evidence. Alright, throw this female back. Alright man, I can't complain back that red rock this is a female and I cut a, uh, a male dungeness so I'm happy with this one dungeon to bring home My wife will be happy too brought home crabs she'll open the door for me uh, so you're gonna get two here maybe do one or two last uh, soaks and that's it but lucky uh yeah no one's been on this jetty really no one passed me at least so I think it's slowing down anyway so it's a good time to go home and eat this dinner of crab. All right, guys, let me do this reel and see what happens. No! 
Oh, I lost a deer. That was a legal dungy. All right, I have a problem. I want a redemption crab. <laughs> One last soap. All right, that's it, guys. I'm gonna do this last reel in. But uh, so that totals to about five for the smoked oysters, three for the sardines. So there you go, the winner of this thing is smoked oysters. I'm gonna do it again. I got that can for a dollar and I was just stuffing them in, uh, just kind of stuffing each little uh, sardine, not sardine, each uh, calamari tube, putting one in. They both seem to work. They both had their ups and downs. Uh, so thanks for watching guys. Like, subscribe, do that thing wherever it is. Uh, I'm going to do this last reel and I want a redemption. I got a problem. That one was a keeper and then it fell right at the end there. But I'm gonna take this crab home. I'll show you what I make with it in another video. That'll be up in a week probably, or less. But uh, thanks for watching guys. Appreciate the crowd on there. Like and subscribe. Here we go guys. Last reel. Nothing. There it is guys. Thanks for watching. Thank <laughs> you.